So Josh and Stacey, first starting off with the need, right now I'm told about a million people in Tampa Bay are not sure where their food is coming from day to day. Many of them are also relying on SNAP benefits. And when those benefits don't show up, viewers tell me there is only one place to turn. We're on the rotation going to food banks to get food to feed ourselves. Dozens of Bay Area families tell Aid on Your Side they're waiting for the state to renew their Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, or SNAP, benefits. In emails, they claim the Florida Department of Children and Families, which runs the federal program, is experiencing a backlog in processing applications. We asked DCF about this alleged backlog two weeks ago. Thus far, the state has declined to comment. But tonight, we're getting new insight about what could be behind the delays viewers are reporting. Renewals have started again. Matt Spence is the chief programs officer for Feeding Tampa Bay, the regional food bank for 10 area counties. His team helps families apply for SNAP benefits. Spence says families were automatically renewed for benefits during the pandemic, but that waiver has now expired, meaning more people are waiting for reapproval. On top of that, we had some pandemic EBT um, challenges, and the state of Florida is now issuing summer 2021 benefits out to those who were eligible. So there's a lot of peanut butter. Summer benefits that were supposed to be distributed in June and July just starting to go out to families in November. Yeah, so that one's no good. The best advice tonight, make sure you have all of your documentation in order. If you have trouble applying online, consider an in-person visit. If you struggle at all, our team at Feeding Tampa Bay is here to assist. The DCF offices do a great job of assisting. So we are on the state to find out more about this backlog. Late today, I asked DCF why summer benefits were just starting to go out in November. I'm waiting to hear back about that, but they did just get back to me regarding this backlog in general. I'm going to have the latest on their response coming up for you at 6 o'clock. Live in the Tampa News Center, Masa Saidi, 8 on your side.